Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you haven't noticed, I'm in a different space. I am on vacation in South Beach. More of a staycation because I'm I already live in South Florida. Um, Miami's like 45 minutes, 30 minutes from me, so it's not too far, but it's still far enough to feel away and relax. So I did some shopping at the Lincoln Road Mall that's on, on Miami Beach. So I wanted to share what I got. Um, with you guys most of it is beauty but some of it is fashion but either way go ahead and subscribe if you have not subscribed hit that notification bell symbol so you are notified anytime I have a new video and comment and like if you like this video and let's get into what I got so the first couple things are fa are fashion and they're from forever 21 and I'll show those first um, the first thing we got um, and I say we I went shopping today with my mom and my daughter um, And she got this shirt. It says girls club And then it has like the knot detailing at the bottom And the shirt was from the forever girls forever 21 girls line and it was nine dollars and ninety cents So that's a cute little shirt She's like, I have to have it. And then, um, because she dances at a studio, her dance recital is coming up this weekend. So I got some things that she's gonna need for her hair that I wanted newer ones of. She has to have her hair in a bun for her performance. So I got a new bun form. Um, it's a little bit bigger than the one that we have right now. And then some hair ties. And each of these were $1.90, but together it was a two for three. So we got both of these for $3. And the next thing is finally for me, um, it's a pair of shoes and it's a pair of shoes that if you would have showed me them a couple years ago, I would have been like, ew, those are so ugly. But I feel like when I saw them, like my style is evolving a little bit. I'm not, I don't know, I'm not, like out of my friends, I'm the least fashionable, I think. I'm okay. Like I love fashion. I, I love looking at nice outfits and things like that, but I don't think I'm I'm not the go-to for everyone. But anyway, I saw these shoes and I like them. Um, but they're not shoes that I would have liked maybe even a year ago, two years ago. So like I said before, I think I'm assuming I'm maturing my style is evolving. At least I hope so. Anyway, they're at a little this is the brand of the shoe. Um I've never heard of it before. It was um, one of the stores on Lincoln Road, and it was the store's closing. So I don't know what the name of it is. I'm sorry, but it was a two for 35 deal. So my mom got a pair of shoes, and I got these. Finally, <laughs> these are the shoes. It is a small wedge, black, and it has rose detailing. And then the front has that as well, and I like that in the front. So that is the shoe. And I think they're cute. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the next couple things are beauty. I got some a couple things from Ricky's and a couple things from Lush. So from Ricky's, the first thing I got, and Ricky's is kind of like a it's a mix between Ricky's is like a mix between S Sally Beauty Supply and Spencer's. Like, I feel like if you put those two stores, like, if they had a baby, it would be Ricky's. Because it's, like, a solid beauty supply, but, like, cooler. I don't know. All right, so the first thing I got was a Ben Nye banana powder. And I usually get it in, like, the kind of, like, jar style, where, like, the top is um, smaller than the body of it. But I got this packaging this time, and this is the Ben Nye luxury banana powder. Let's use this now. Um, and the price difference was $5 less than the size that I would have gotten and it's almost the same amount of product so I told her ring me up for that one <laughs> when I was in there just to you know save a couple bucks next thing I got was just to try out some looks I'm definitely gonna do a video using this the NYX vivid bright liner and this is the lavender or yeah lavender shade and this and that is called vivid blossom so I definitely want to do a look with that and then the last thing just got three things 
is a makeup setting spray by the brand J Cat. And it's a makeup setting spray infused with aloe vera. And it doesn't claim to do anything special, doesn't say why aloe vera is so good for you, but I heard it is. But just wanted to try it out. It's a little like sample size. So that's what I got from Ricky's. Last place, Lush. First from Lush, I'll show you the samples. My daughter got a free sample and I got a sample too. She got the Olive Branch shower gel. And it's not the jelly that looks like jello, it's like a shower gel. Smells really good. And then I got the Mask of Magnanimity. I hope I'm, yeah, Magnaminty. Magnaminty. <laughs> the Mask of Magnaminty. Um, to try out it's really minty uh, I'm I don't know if it has charcoal in it no I don't think so but it, it's like a clay type mask and she said it will feel tight tightening and um, it'll harden on the face so we we'll have to try that out and then I got a hot oil treatment and it looks like this it's like on a popsicle stick and then it has like directions on how to use it. It's a hot oil treatment. And this one that I got is called Damaged. It kind of is like a pictograph of how you use it. You melt it, you put it in a container, put some on, and you could save the rest in a container. She said this amount melts down a lot into a lot. You can see like the size comparison in my hand of how big it is. So I'm excited for that because my hair needs it. After these braids are out, I'm going to be doing this a lot. And then probably some more braids, just so I will leave my hair alone. The next thing I, this one is so pretty. This is, let me look at the names. I already told you, I know, so I got those names right, but I want to get this one right. This one is called the Rose Jam Bubble Rune. And this is newer to me, maybe it's not new. But it looks like a rose, and it has like glitter specs on it it smells like rose argon skin conditioner i've used that before by lush but it's a bubble bar on the top and the bottom and then in between she said it's really moisturizing something it has cocoa butter and moisturizing stuff in between and it looks like a macaroon that's why it's called a bubble room and it's so pretty um that's what i got i might share a little piece with my daughter when she takes a bath, but she wants to use her shower gel. And has this free, so I said, yeah, go ahead, use it, cheers. <laughs> and then the last thing I got was a body butter. Now when I looked at the body butters, I assumed that after you shower or you take a bath, when you get out, you pat yourself dry, and then you rub it on your skin, moisturizes it like lotion, but that's not the case. Looking at the directions, it said to, while you're in the shower, massage it into your skin and you're still wet and then rinse it off i'll try it that way and then i think i'll also try it the other way but that's what i thought it would be anyway so i got one and it's called the scrubby body butter there's nothing that feels like it would scrub or be exfoliating but it's in the shape of a b scrubby and there's like stripes if you can see and then there's two little dots here that kind of make it look like a bee and it has honey and cocoa butter in it and it feels really moisturizing on the skin so I'm excited for that I haven't gotten I think the last time I was in Lush and got stuff was when we were here last year because we go here this is like our kickoff to summer we're here on South Beach almost every summer for the, for the past couple of summers so I got some other little samples because there are some other like beauty shops that I've never heard of before. Um, on the ship, we got lunch, different things. I'm going to have a whole vlog of the trip on my new vlog channel. So that will be linked as soon as it's available, but this video will be up first. So that's all I got. Not much. Thank you so much for watching. Again, subscribe if you have not subscribe. Subscribe. Subscribe if you have not subscribed already and be sure to hit that notification bell because youtube and instagram and everybody is changing stuff so you don't see who you are subscribed to and you won't know when they post or see their new pictures all that type of stuff so all my 
info will be below and if you enjoyed it share with a friend and i will see you guys next time bye